I'm going to talk about this and this together in this video. So variants. It's important to know that regex is used in a lot of different platforms. I mentioned that earlier. Things like JavaScript and Linux and PowerShell and Python. So they do vary slightly from one to the other. And these symbols might be a little bit different in one or another of those languages. So just be aware of that. However, having said that, here's a cool tester, interactive tester, Regex 101. I'm going to go ahead and click on that, and we'll bring that up and take a look at, uh, at that web page. And here it comes, Regex 101. So in here, I can put some string. I'll put my name. And now I can put my regular expression up here and see whether I have a match or don't have a match. So, for example, uh, let's do a capital R. And let's see if I have a match. Oh, yes, I do have a match right here. Because R does appear and it shows me exactly what matched and what doesn't match. Now, I might want a regular expression that matches everything here. Well, then I have to come up with something else so that I can match everything. Remember I said that a dot asterisk is very similar. In fact, it's about the same as just the asterisk as a wild card. So now I have that has an R in it and then anything after that R. And there it is. So this is a really cool thing. You can put your test string down here and then you can see whether it matches or not. Way awesome. Uh, note that Tester is designed for four different variants of which PowerShell is not one. <laughs> so that is a, you know, a little bit uh, disconcerting. Let's go back to here to a, this. I can have I've got PHP, JavaScript, Python, and Golang, whichever, whatever that is. I'm not a coder, so I don't know much about that. But um, it works pretty well with the PowerShell ones, and so uh, we use it in here. 